I might have enough CP to get the next upgrades to speeding these things up. The faster they go, the faster I get money, the faster I get money, the faster I can buy stuff, the faster I can buy stuff, the faster I invest. It's a self-fulfilling prophecy. Mm -hmm. What the crap? What's that odd-looking woman doing? Is she checking out the office? Come to think of it, there was that call. A woman with bobbed hair. So that woman must be from their investigation department. Now the taxation experts that investigate companies for tax evasion. She's, she's one of them. Or she's just a weirdo. I, I guess we're gonna go talk to this weirdo. Hi. Hello, weirdo lady. Oi. Are you maybe... What is it? Are you, uh, Marusa? Marusa? What do you mean by Marusa? Well, you have a bob haircut. You must be the woman who called me, aren't you? What are you saying? I'm not Marusa. My name's kind of close, but... I'm hungry! I am confused. <laughs> I am the one from Marusa. What was the point of that, you are? Yeah. Sorry for not introducing myself sooner. I'm Agent Maru. I have the Regional Taxation Bureau's Criminal Investigation Department, aka Marusa. Who the hell was that other lady? Anyway, whatever. You want to talk to me about something? Yeah, I was hoping to. What's that? Kitasan, I need your assistance in a delicate matter. The president has been kidnapped. Are you a bad enough dude? What kind of assistance? You mean Marusa needs help? Precisely. Kirasan, have you had any dealings with your neighbor Maguro Enterprises and the office next door? Yeah. There's an office next door? I didn't know the name of the business until now. Good. That's ideal. We're investigating Maguro Enterprises for tax evasion. Evasion? That's what Al got. Guess what got Al Capone? Shush, keep it down. You'll scare my haircut. We were tipped off on Maguro's infraction by an informant who had dealings with them. Our source promised to deliver evidence to back it up, but then he died. Your source might have been silenced. Forever. I'm afraid so. I need to get the goods on Maguro Enterprises, but if I did it myself, Maguro might notice a stranger sniffing around and becoming suspicious. But if you were seen with me's next door neighbor, your presence can be explained. And that's why you want my help with this? Noice! Couldn't have put it better myself. You catch on fast, like my glasses. Yeah. I get the picture, but I don't really have much of a stake in this. Nope! You're not obliged in any way, or obligated, whatever. But if you were to offer assistance, you won't regret it. In more ways than one, I would think. What's that supposed to mean? And how many times am I going to point at your face? You're taking on the five billionaires, right? That's on top of figuring out how to run a business. Not too easy for you, is it? How do you know that? <laughs> and with Marusa, remember, there's nothing compared to the kind of information we work with. Why does everybody know everything about me, but me? Here's the deal. Help me, and I'll help you with your business. Not a bad deal, is it? Oh, man, I hope you're an advisor. You're serious? Yep. Now I know the industry inside out. My support's invaluable. And you say? True. So, decision time. You gonna help me out, or, like, what? I agree to help. Uh. Fine. Tax evasion is a serious crime with serious consequences. Except for all those people who get away with it all the damn time. Oy. I'll do my part for the good of society. <laughs> good. We have a deal. Really works out in my favor. Hey, Marusa lady. Yes, Kirusan. By the way, I told you my name is Marui. Why are we all up in our face? <laughs> Marusan, you're, uh, kind of close. It's a brilliant cover, though. By pretending to be a couple, we can loiter without arousing suspicion. Uh, all right. Ah! What's the matter, Marusan? Shush, quiet. It's Maguro. The head honcho from Maguro Enterprises is coming. Well, I can tell by his hairstyle and his turd-colored suit that he's up to no good. Hmm? Hmm? staring at us. It's okay. Just fraternizing. Yeah, I'll still just go with it. Huh? That kid's all of a sudden. Oh, right. The cover. Play along. We have to convince him. We're doing a thing. Fine. I will commit in the most middle of ways. I don't even know what this is. What the? Whoa! Well, we made it weird. Sorry. You awoke the woman in me. Why does that always seem to happen to me? <laughs> what? Wait. What about Magoro? Can I fucking... <laughs> Can I help you, sir? Get a room. Yes, it worked. Good job. Eh, wait a second. You're... Uh-oh. Does he suspect something? 
Yeah, you're from the office next door, aren't you? I've seen you going in and out. Uh, yeah, I'm Kiru. I was recently put in charge here. Sorry for not introducing myself sooner, but I don't care. Ooh. I'm Magudo! I'm in real estate. No, I should have introduced myself sooner, too. Anyway, kiru I'm impressed. You're the man in charge at such a young age. Let's bring a lot to the table. Nah, it's just circumstantial. <laughs> and must too. Hmm, cool. Eh, anyway, to the office for tea. I'd like to get my own, my neighbor. Eh? Oh, wait, I shouldn't be interrupting your fun. Sorry, that was inconsiderate of me. Interrupting her fun. Oh, right, this lady. Uh, please pay me no heed. I'm his, uh, secretary. Sure. What? You're dating your own secretary. That must be nice. I really got to get to know you better. Please do come for a visit. I don't know. This is a perfect opportunity. We've gained entry into Maguro Enterprises. I knew you were the right man for the job, Kurosan. Oh, right. That is what we're doing. What if our cover's blown? Danger comes with the territory. I'll do whatever it takes to expose Maguro's shady dealings. Eh, got it. I'm in this with you to the end. Something wrong? No, no. We were just saying uh, we should take you up on your kind offer and visit your office. I see, I see. Then please, this way. Ah, his suit changed color from turds to... S slightly unhealthier turd. Oh, no one here. My staff and even my secretary are out. No matter. I can prepare tea myself. Have a seat. Make yourself comfortable. All right. I shall do that thing. Well, that was easy. This is our chance to search. Off I go! Oi. You sure about this, Marosan? There's no telling when he'll come back. Tell me, what's he doing now? Making tea. A standard teapot's capacity is between 400 to 600 mil ml mi millimeters? I don't know. To prepare tea for three and some refills, he would need two pots, so he needs to boil a liter of water. To boil a liter of water in a kettle takes about four minutes of high heat. That man likely gets a secretary to make tea, so he'll need time finding the tea leaves. All in all, we all have about seven minutes to conduct a search before he runs, returns with our tea. Do you follow? Damn, son. This isn't so much as Mara says, it's just common sense. Also, rather than working those gums, how about you get busy? I doubt financial statements will mean anything to you, Kirasan. Look for anything suspicious instead. Got it. <laughs> Umbrellas! Uh, 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 calendars! There's a talisman to ward off evil behind this calendar. Is this place okay? Uh, 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 uh. Horses! And one of those things where you can draw in one of the eyes, but you don't do that unless you do a thing. I don't know. A drama and prancing stallions. That's got taste. I want a drama. Some kind of VHS tapes! The video rack, is there something odd about it? Something's wrong. What's odd about it? Uh, it's presents? I mean, it's a real estate for Arsan. Don't you think this video rack is odd? I don't see anything odd about it. There's something wrong with the video rack itself, but it's strange that it's here in this room at all. It being here is odd? I think so. There's no TV! Oh, you're right! There's all these videos, but neither a TV nor a VCR to play them on. Right, it's too bulky to be just placed here on a temporary basis. Besides, there's dust here that shows it hasn't been moved recently. There's something clearly unnatural about this video rack. <laughs> Kiro-san, that's on the money. They must be hiding something in these videotapes. I shall consume them. To think he would hide evidence in plain sight in his office. My girl's bold, I'll give him that. So, if you were to examine these videotapes... Kiro-san! Sorry, but can you open the door for me? I'm holding a tray. Sure, I'll do that. That was fast. What do we do? You know where to look now, so maybe we should come back another time? Nay! I can't risk having him move the evidence. We're settling this now. Yeah, but McGurl's back. We can't keep searching. True. I don't have any choice. It's time for the last resort. Last resort? Oh, no. Oh, no! I'm not looking forward to whatever this is. Sorry to keep you folks waiting. Usually get my secretary to serve tea, so I had to track down the tea leaves. Yeah. By God. You knew it right ahead of time. Thank you very much. Speaking of, why is your secretary taking a seat? Oh, I'm sorry for my awkwardness. I threw out my back, and sitting is simply agonizing. Ouch! That's rough. I know how bad it is to throw out your back. I'm quite fat. Yeah, so I much prefer to stand. Please don't mind me. Remember what I just told you, Kirsan. Keep my girl focused on you while I examine all the video cassettes. There's no way this is going to work. You can do- How are we able to talk to each other this far away without him noticing? You can do it, Kirosan. You're a man with the balls to do this, and Marzu gets bitten by their balls. That made no sense. What's wrong? Can't take our eyes off each other, huh? Oh, no, it's nothing. <laughs> ah, must be nice. Anyway, Kirosan, if you don't mind me asking, how'd you get to be in charge of your own office at such a young age? 
Well, it's a little complicated. I was approached by this man, you see. You look like I'm searching for stuff. Man, she's got nerves of steel. If my girl were to glance behind him, we'd be toast. Oh, I see. It's amazing how a single chance meeting can change your life completely, isn't it? You seem a little distracted. Something bothering you? Huh? You think so? It's just... Something seems to be distracting you a lot. What's bothering you? <laughs> uh, you've got great taste in turned themed clothing. What? My clothes? <laughs> so you can tell, can you? I bought these on an impulse just the other day. Cost a fair amount, too. Around 800000 or so. It's a great brand, and the designer's a big name worldwide. You have to add it to their sense of style. I mean, you can tell it's quality piece by... Shuffle, shuffle, shuffle. Words, words, words. It just looks like you're cleaning the floor aggressively. Okay, manage to get through that. It's not just clothes for me, either. I have a collection of watches, too. They're at home, of course, but the German-made timepieces? Huh, my girl likes the sound of his own voice. This is good. Gotta keep him talking and buy some time. Kirisan, I have to tell you, I'm impressed by how well your business is doing. Yeah. Oh, I don't think we're doing anything too differently. <laughs> How modest of you! I wish your success would rub off on us next door. The world being the way it is, the one where the money wins. It doesn't matter how they got it, either. Doesn't matter at all. Oh, excuse me. Got lost in my own thoughts there. Tell me, Kurosan, you're obviously well off, but is there anything you still want? Something I want? Let's see. <laughs> A VCR. Well, I mean, I am currently homeless. I live at the park. A house, maybe. Oh, a house, you say? What sort of property are you considering? Hmm? Really perked up there. Oh, right, of course. You're in real estate. <laughs> you forgot? Comprehensive support for finding your dream property. You get it all at McGurr Enterprises. So, what areas are you considering for your new home? Single family home, condo, floor space. What up? Well, let's see. I don't even know what she's doing. There, I kept his attention focused on me. <laughs> Well, I must say, I'm glad I finally got to meet you, Kira-san. I enjoyed chatting with you, too. Uh, yeah, same here. He's trying to wrap things up. Is she done? Oh, yeah. Fantissimo! She wants more time. Oh, boy, easy for her to say. Well, Kira-san, I enjoyed your visit, but I should be getting back to work now. How do I buy more time? That's all I can do that isn't weird. Uh, may I shake your hand? Shake hands? Why, of course. Here's to a fruitful relationship. You can tell a lot by a handshake. Oh, yes, I hope so. I very much hope so. If you ever have any good tips for me, I'd love to get in on it. Uh, we're going to be next door neighbors for a long time. Should get to know each other. Well, you agreed, but you've got quite a grip, Tiger. Can I have my hand back now? No. Just wait. Oh, Lord, this is weird. You fantasizing about something? Oh, Lord, this was a bad call. Well, Kurosan, thanks for visiting. Feel free to drop by anytime for tea. Oh, yeah. There, gotcha. This is it. What? Huh? I'm out of here. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. This is going to get weird. This is going to get weird. I found this bank book and a videotape. Interesting. These numbers don't seem to match the revenue figures in your tax filings. What the t Are you from Marasa? I was merely invited alongside as Kurosan's friend. But yes, coincidentally, I happen to work for the Criminal Investigation Department of the Regional Taxation Bureau. I'm rather dismayed that I stumbled upon evidence of your tax evasion on my private time. Uh -huh. Damn you! I'll kill you! You want to consider the consequences first? If you kill me, you're guaranteed a life sentence. Stay on your best behavior, and you might be lucky enough to get parole in 30 years. How old will you be by then? If you're willing to stay caged that long. Go ahead. Kill me. Nyarg! <laughs> I thought he was like, I have to use the bathroom! <laughs> okay. That's not usually my response to trouble, but there you go. Well, that was surprisingly effective. <laughs> Kirasan, thanks to you, we got evidence of that tax evasion. You did a great job leaving Maragora's attention away from me. You did better than I could have hoped. <laughs> and just doing my part for our country. Patriotism. Like I promised, I'll help you with your business. Of course, I will expect to be compensated fairly. Lady. NANI?! <laughs> of course not. Besides, it's peanuts to you. In this day and age, money's flowing like water. I feel like I got the short end of this stick. Anyway. hey, She's an advisor. Sweet. Oh, and she's good at that's some stuff. That's good. That's good. And Kurosan, make sure your office keeps filling your taxes properly. Got it? No argument from me. I just got a first-hand demonstration of how scary Marasova can be. You know it. Crime doesn't pay. This is for you, as thanks for your help. Well, you have it. Ooh, a trouble finder. 
Marasa looks everywhere, sniffing around wherever dirty money leaves its stench. It smells... You know, I mean, it, unsurprisingly, it smells like sweat, drugs, and more sweat. A different kind. Could be watching you, out of sight, but never far away. Yeah. What is it? What are you? Some kind of life model decoy? Jesus! Yeah, Alright, well, that was an event. I do enjoy the various amounts of, like, funny stuff you can do in this game. Seriously, I've more than got uh, pretty much all my money's worth. Anyway, with this, I should be able to afford at least one of the other buildings. I need to buy at least three of them. There we go! Oh, this is great! Alright. Now let's see. Let's focus on this. Investo! There we go. That's making progress happen. I should be investing I should be investing in everything. Just wanted to see if I could make those numbers go up a bit better. She is expensive, but she also does know what she's doing. She's making them boosts happen, son. Now, if only I could find an advisor who's halfway competent in their ability to deal with, I don't even know what, the food, eateries? I don't even know, man. I already got an expert on the entertainment businesses. All right, that's everything. There we go, there we go, there we go. More money for me! Ha ha ha! Let's go. I feel like we're actually doing some pretty good progress here. Mm-hmm. Kind of want to keep going. I'm hungry as hell, but I still feel like playing games. And sometimes video games just have to take precedent over the thing that keeps you alive. Let's see. That way should lead me straight to the shrine. Dang it. Ah, whoa. So sorry. Didn't mean to do that. I apparently have a hard time making sharp turns. How dare you call me a dweeb? I'll smacketh you up like no one's business. I ain't no narc. Am I a dweeb or am I a narc? You guys gotta get your story straight. Also, this guy needs to stop wearing pink. Very few men can handle wearing pink in public, okay? That's Wario and Dan Hibiki. They're the only ones man enough to be manly about it. You, sir, are not one of those people. Bicycle! <laughs> no one ever expects my bicycle foo. That's just gonna be my. I feel. I just feel like that's what like uh, Kiru just uses like canonically. That's his fighting style: hitting people with bikes. Eh, it just sounds hilarious and funny to me, and I like it. Plus, you can't argue with its effectiveness. If you've got the upper body strike to sling bikes and motorcycles around, you might as well use them as weapons. Running, 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 running. Get out of the way, Mr. Clown Man. All right, time to exchange some more CP. Let's see, I got 14. Not bad. Quick collection. Reduce the time. Hell yes. Office Fang Shui. Hell yes. There we go. Should speed things up a wee bit. All right, but the question is, what do we do now? I was lucky enough that I just kind of kept bumbling my way into new events. I wonder if that's something that I can actually keep doing. You know what? Let's just run around town, see what happens. Like this guy. These people f seem like fine fellows in need of a face, a, a fist to the face. Has this guy wield some kind of kniff? You're not the kniff wielder. Oh my goodness. Uh, I swear, all I wanted to do was fight Mr. Kniff. My kniffle! Ow, again with the stabbing and the ouchies. Ooh, the ouchies. Oh, the ouchies. Why you gotta be all like that? All right, get over here. Eh. What are you gonna do about that, huh? Huh? Nothing. Eh. There we go. Now I'm just gonna grab this knife and then... Ow. Oh, I was gonna shank you good. Man, everybody gotta be making my job that much harder. You have any idea how easy it would have been just to, sh to, sh to shank you? Just shank you good? Although, that does remind me, I should probably be heading over in this general direction. 
in the hopes that I can actually purchase another one of them thingamaroos. I've got a decent amount of money. Not a ton, but, you know. Hopefully enough to get one of them. Gotta buy three of these damn blazes. Running in the 80s. It's not quite as catchy a song. Just keep on running in the 80s. Oh. I accidentally stopped and I didn't mean to. Oh well. Let's see. This is one of the places I bought already. You're like, what? Ah, no, it's not. This shows popular films from the West, as well as artsy Japanese films. I'll take it! Sweet. Alright, well, that's that place. Let's see, what about this place? Hmm, they say lots of couples come here for dates. Should I purchase that noise? Well, as much as I'd love to, I barely don't have enough money. Actually, if I find some people around here to beat up, I might be able to. Like these guys. I'm willing to bet I could probably get a large chunk of money from these dudes. At least, at the very least, enough to be able to buy them. I'm buying a lot of movie theaters. It's kind of strange. I wonder if I can use this as a weapon. Yes, I can! How ironic that I would use a no bicycles sign. Ow. Bicycle! What are you gonna do? Hey, you, what you got? See, now you've earned my... Yeah, you've earned my scorn. See, now you get the full front of my bicycle foo. Ah, oh, that's not anywhere near enough to be able to buy this place. You guys are cheapskates. Oh, but you know what I could do? I do have, like, a bunch of, like, stuff from people. Whoa, when the hell did I get this? A leopard print coat. I don't remember ever getting this. Hmm. Is it any good? Uh, this sure brings out your wild side. Oh, wait, no, that's what I got. Oh, it's it's clearly a woman's thing, so no. no. Well, let's see. This device is said to help find people around town who are in need of help. Well, that sounds delightful. All right, let's see. How far away is the pawn shop? Other than pretty gosh darn. There's Mahjong. That's the arcade. Oh, please don't tell me you're... Okay, that's the shogi parlor. You know, I've never been there, and I don't want to go there, but I feel like I have to go there. Karaoke bar. What the? There's definitely... What about you? No. What? I've been to a pawn shop. You can't say. Ah, there we go. It's all the way down there. Okay. Although, at the same time, I'm seeing an exclamation point up here. Somebody in need of help? Racers wanted? Wait, what? Hang on. What's going on? I'm looking around. I don't see anybody in, being harassed. Oh! New pocket circuit races. Uh, yeah, pocket circuit racers wanted. Pocket circuit racing? I bought one of those for an extraordinarily large amount of money. Oh, hi there! How about some pocket circuit racing? We're looking for more people to join in. Pocket circuit? What's that? You race motorized model cars around a track. Everyone's doing it these days. Young and old. The car's small enough to fit in your pocket. That's the name. Pocket sized race cars? Yeah, it's all the rage right now. In a few more years, it'll be all about them. Pocket monsters, but now, no. Pocket circuits. Where races are held. Let's see, what's that all about? How did I miss that sign? Is that supposed to be a bird? Give it a try sometime. I'm sure you'll be hooked. Pocket circuit, huh? Eh, it could be fun. Well, it's not like I got anywhere else to be. Hang on, let me just check. Yep. Still gotta wait a little bit longer anyway. So yeah. And I've I already know that I've got all some I've got some really good pieces and stuff. Oi, look at these children. Look at these tiny childs. Look at them thinking they know what's up. So this is Pocket Circuit Stadium. Looks like a popular spot. Who's this man with the fancy pants? Ah, what do we have here? This is your first time at the Pocket Circuit Stadium. Hello, I'm from the 80s. I'll be your guide. This guy's decked out like a Christmas tree. Uh, yeah, I heard this was the new craze. So I came for a look. You're completely new to slot cart racing, huh? Nice to have some fresh blood. Ooh, dark. Oh, I forgot to introduce myself. I'm... Pocket Circuit Haita! I handle registration and race commentary. Commentary? For the races? Of course. Gets everybody really amped up. It's true. Commentary is vitally important to stuff like this. 
So what's your name? I'm Kazuma Kiru. Well, buddy, I'll call you Kazuma-kun. Uh, Kazuma-kun? You don't mind if I call you that, right? We like to keep things informal around here. So everyone's kun or chan. So Kazuma-kun it is. You wouldn't be the first, second, or 37th person to call me that, so yeah, sure, whatever. You're a complete newbie when it comes to pocket circuit, huh? Yeah, but I heard a uh, little from about it outside. You race motorized model cars, yeah? Oh, That's right, but racing them's only the beginning. Customizing cars is where the real action's at. Customizing cars? Yeah. When in a race after customizing your car with all sorts of components is super fun. You can buy components from the po po yeah, Pocket Circuit Stadium shop over there. I already got some sweet parts. You might find components around town, too. You can make your very own speed demon. Okay, I get the gist. Sounds like there's more to this than the meets the eye. Makes sense with the cars and the robots. I understand why it's so popular now. There are rumors of awesome components available at the high-end Dream Machine vetting machines, too. Yeah, it's true. I have gotten stuff to come out of that. If you ever want to know more about Pocket Circuit, just say the word. I'm here to help. Thanks for filling me in. Hope to see you back here. I'll be waiting. Pocket Circuit does seem pretty fun. I should ask Fighter more about it sometime. If by sometime you mean right now. You, Mr. Man, tell me about all of the words. Hey, Kazuma Khan. Right, Kazuma Khan. You decided to give Pocket Circuit a shot, huh? Yeah, it looks fun. Thought I'd try it out. Awesome! I'm so glad you stopped by. Having a new opponent to race really gets my competitive spirit going. Okay. To commemorate your Pocket Circuit debut, here's a card to get you started. You're giving it to me? Sure, it's all yours. Pocket Circuit has its fair share of grown-up fans, but most racers are kids. I'd be stoked to see more people your our age getting involved, so think of it as a little incentive. <laughs> well, I can't say no to free. Oh, dang. The Golem Tiger. Oh, the Slick Tigers. Oh, the Power Motor. Oh, the Balanced Frame. Oh, Regular Gears. You got- Oh, holy hell, there's a lot of pieces in this thing! Let's have a race! I'll show you what Pocket Circuit's all about! Sure, sounds good. I'm all for all these mini-games that keep on happening. Mad fun, yo. Alright. Boost. Stabilized. Fast forward, huh? Alright. Alright, uh, whoa! Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. It's simple. Slot cars are placed in lanes, and it's the one to the finish. All laps first wins. But you don't just stand there and watch. You can give your car a boost of speed, for example. Oh, speed! Now, that's what I call speed, but the number of times you can boost your car is limited, and it makes it easier to fall out of lane. So try not to mess that noise up. Just like that, your car's about to fall out! Quickly! Stabilization! That was close. Pressing circle to save your car only works when you have the energy in your top left gauge, though. So don't mess it up! So, uh, feeling impatient? You can fast forward the race. Oh. Interesting. Now that you can save a lot of time, huh? That'll give you more time for more races! Also, somehow I got in first. You run out of speed boostu? Alright, how do I customize my vehicle? If there's ever anything else you want to know, just ask. We're about the same age, so I can tell you a few things from experience. Okay! Cool. Let's see, is it like a thing in my menu? How many su- I've only done 27 out of 60 sub-stories! What? How's that possible? I feel like I've done about a billion and a half of the things! My goodness. Alright, but... I want to do some customization! I want to customize my car! I want to go fast! You got any parts to help me go fast? Alright, I also- oh, there's the killer bee. Let's see... This one seems to be all around better. I mean, it's it's identical in every way, except for the fact that its balance is way better. Okay, this all makes sense to me. Let's see, tires. Increase grip, but lower speed? No thanks! Cornering, and that doesn't, doesn't really doesn't seem to do much of anything for my speed. Wow, that really lowers your cornering. Now all this just flat out improves it. I'll take it. Or rather, I'll use it. Ah, there's a boost of speed. That's what I'm looking for. 
Let's see. Uh, I'll leave that be for now. That's a straight improvement. Side stabilizers. Hmm. They don't seem to be making much of a difference. All right, we'll just leave it as is. That does nothing different. Decal, red blaze. Where the, where did it even go? The color, body color. Oh, sweet. I do enjoy a good blue car. Yeah, that'll do. Cool. My killer bee looks nothing like a bee. Can't help but notice. Anyway, all right. So your car all souped up. Souped up like some kind of fine soup. So yeah, let's enter a race. I am ready to party town like some kind of crazy person. Let's see, the introductory race. Very well. I am prepared. I don't want to customize things. I'm, we're good. We're good. Select star car. Yeah, I want to use this one. Oh, okay. You're over the cost limit, so the race can't be started. What? That's such a large pile of butts and butt-related butts. All right, fine. Then I'll use this terrible car. All righty. It's time to go, crappy car I don't want to use. Oh. I'm going to beat the hell out of these children. And these are some cool looking cars. Reminds me of Mario Party. Go! It's time for speed! Is it just me, or did I just, like, freaking book it? Like, where'd the other cars go? Where'd they go? I can't see them! Oh, there they are. Hi, I found you! What the? How are you ahead of me? I am confused. Yeah, I have lost my position, and I don't know how. Can I only boost once? Well, that's confusing. I was in first place for the entire thing, and then all of a sudden everything just went terrible, and now I'm getting lapped? Oh, wait, no, I just got fourth. I have failed. I am a disgrace. Kiru is clearly very depressed about what just happened. Sorry you didn't come out on top, Kazuma-kun. Try customizing your dang car. If I must. Okay. Clearly, I need to customize this golem thingy. The starter car is too, isn't good enough, whereas the car that I made is just too dang good. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's customize. Let's see here. Like the battery. The battery! There we go. Just boost the speed up. There we go. Boost up the motor. Get yourself that better frame going on here. Get that bumper plate going for you. All right. There. It's still within the, you know, the, 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 the parameters, but it's also better. All right. It's time to race. Yes, yes, yes. I know. I've been here. I've done this. This ain't my first rodeo. Okay, here we go! Alright, so far I'm already in first place, and I haven't even used my mighty boosts. I'll save my boost for when things get trickier. If there's anything I've learned about these children, it's that they have a weird habit of suddenly sh being better than you out of nowhere. Then again, I'm about to lap this fool! Out of the way, nerd! Okay, I think I just made my car, like, just freakishly amazing, and I don't think they're actually going to be able to catch it. Yeah, they're not going to. This car is just too good. I am your new god. What a difference 10 seconds makes. Yeah, take that, kids. Woo! Where'd this confetti come from? He's so proud. 
Kiru might just be one of the most likable characters I've ever played as. Now some thrilling racing there. I'm feeling funky fresh, let me tell ya. Let's do another one. Alright, let's enter, enter, enter the race. I'm already probably able to... I'm more than... I'm definitely able to go and get the, uh, the payouts. So that's good. Aw, oh, dang. Okay, a fun challenge for young racers. Huh. All right, well, let's give it a try. Let's see. Ah, and that one's still too good. All right, fine. I'll have to settle for uh, my not as good thing here. Yeah, let's race. Yeah, let's go. All right, I'm in the red lane. I don't know, man. Yellow's been lucky for me so far. And... All right. They're already going faster than I am. This is already proving to not be well for me. Then again, I, I think I'm catching up. Wait, suddenly I'm in first. Okay. That's fine. It's fine. Just keep going. Just keep going. Nothing to worry about. Everything's good. I'm in fourth place. Nothing wrong with being in fourth place. F fourth, fourth place. All right, that's it. We're going to have to go. Super Saiyan! I should use that in the last lap, I feel. Man, okay. Apparently, using the boost, just the... Not the grace of timing. Oh, you took over my place at the last possible second, lady. I assume you are a small child girl. My. Man, I either win or I get completely destroyed. You're in good form again today. Thanks. Hey, fighter. Huh? Oh, it's you, Taku uh, Takuma. What up? What? Now that's a tricky word for someone your age. Breast. But no more saying words you don't know the meaning of, okay? Promise me. Fighter seems pretty good at dealing with kids. I would just straight up drop kick to that fool. But I know what it means. It's when you've never gone out with a girl before. Uh, not exactly. Close enough, I guess. Anyway, where'd you hear that word? From Hideki Kun. Hey, Hideki Kun! Mm -hmm. Friggin' what? You need more style tips? Because I've got the best quote. So, you're the one stirring things up, huh, Hideki Kun? You should know better than to use language like that. But my honest sense, some, anyone spending so much time with Pocket Circuit at your age has got to be one. That's very unkind of your mother to say. Anyway, she's wrong. Ah, oh, great. Now they have a synchronized dance movement. They've practiced this. No, I'm not. The poor guy looks pretty miserable. He just wants to spread the joy of Pocket Circuit Racing. I need to clear this mess up or we'll never get back to Pocket Circuit Racing. Well, reprimanding isn't going to work. Wait. You know what? Sure, let's just go with this one. I'm sure it won't lead to any awkwardness. Uh -huh. Eh? Really? Uh -huh. Eh? He's super cool. Bet he has girls throwing themselves at him all the time. How would girls throw themselves? That sounds dangerous. Anyway, if you're a cool guy like you says so, I guess I might have been wrong. Sorry, we made fun of you, fighter. Yeah, we're sorry. Oh, no problem. Haha, <laughs> I'm just glad you understand. All right, now that that's cleared up, go back and play. All right. Because that's what bros do. Uh, thanks for that, Kazuma Gun. Oh, mention it. Keep your chin up, huh? Kazuma Gun. I know you defended me, but what the kids said about me, uh, I mean, it is true. Oh. I mean, I kind of assumed. Well, it happens at different times for everyone. It's not like it's a race or anything. <laughs> if it is, guess who's in last place? It's nobody in the game. Huh. Oh, well, what are you going to do? I'll be 30 next year. Oh. Getting up there, huh? Okay, well, I mean, I guess you're ahead of me in, in age. But still. I don't even know what's the common age for that anymore. I guess it is different for everybody. Hmm. I don't know. I'm sure I'll reach 30 without it happening. <laughs> it doesn't really matter. Yeah, you can only call yourself a late bloomer so long. All this time, I've never even held a girl's hand. It's pretty shameful. See, let's talk about it in those kind of aspects. Yeah, I, I'm, st I'm still on that level. Still, guess that's what I get for being the pocket circuit fighter at this age. No oh, wonder the kids tease me. Hey, you have plenty to be proud of. Eh? Your talent is being able to see things from a kid's perspective and enjoy the same things they do. Not everyone can do that. I think you're fine just the way you are, fighter. You have nothing to be ashamed of. Kazuma kun. Well, dang. I've only known you for like 15 minutes, but you're my best friend. 
<laughs> this won't do. I need to pull myself together. I feel a lot better now, thanks to you, Cosm Kun. I'm done feeling sorry for myself. Good. Hang in there, fighter. Thanks. Come back for another race sometime. I look forward to seeing how you do. Once I have better parts, you're on. Of course, it's not like I needed another thing to spend money on. Well, they've jettisoned me from the building, which it works out pretty well, because I've only become more hungry as time has gone by. So, uh, yeah. In the next part, I guess we'll just... I guess we'll keep on racing and keep on real estating and bump into more sub-stories as we do. I'm 100% in this fool. I don't give a dang how long it takes. This game is fun. I'll see you all then.